In the 1960s and 1970s, when the US and Iran were on friendly terms, the US delivered 225 F-4D and F-4Es, and also four reconnaissance phantoms dubbed the RF-4E to Iran. This made Iran the second largest export customer. The Imperial Iranian Air Force saw at least one engagement, resulting in a loss after a reconnaissance phantom was rammed by a Soviet MiG-21 during Project Dark Gene, an ELINT operation during the Cold War. The Islamic Republic of Iran Air Force phantoms saw heavy action in the Iran-Iraq War in the 1980s, and were kept operational by overhaul and servicing from Iran's aerospace industry. Notable operations of Iranian F-4s during the war included Operation Scorch Sword, an attack by F-4 Phantoms against the Iraqi Osirak nuclear reactor site near Baghdad on the 30th of September 1980, and an attack on the H-3 airbase on the 4th of April 1981 by eight Iranian F-4 Phantoms in the far west of Iraq, which resulted in as many as 60 Iraqi aircraft being destroyed or damaged on the ground for no Iranian losses. From the early days in Vietnam to the Iran-Iraq War, the F-4 Phantom boasts a distinguished service career and remains in service with several countries to this day. All right, we got a whole bunch of Iraqi aircraft off in front, uh, a lot of it actually, um, probably Mirage F-1s and MiG-21s. Go ahead and select our sidewinders because I think we're going to the merge, they're right around here. Yeah, there's a bunch of uh, AAA. And we gotta be careful with who we shoot. That actually looks like an F-14 over there. Because there's gonna be friendly aircraft in the area. The Iranians were using the Phantom, the F-5, the F-14. Uh, a lot of American tech was used uh, by Iran in the Iran-Iraq War. Uh, what is this guy up here? That looks like a Iraqi MiG-21. There's the Star Fox 2. And I don't think that's gonna hit him, but oh, well, we got him. Hey, all right, splash one. Okay, splash that guy, and there's another MiG-21 right underneath him, conveniently placed for me to just slip onto a six here. Let's see if we can do something with that. He is merged with, I think, two other aircraft. There he goes, he's getting behind that mountain there. No problem. Right over the city, it looks like. Yeah, he's on the tail of an Iranian F-4. I think he saw me, so he's breaking off. He's trying to defend, Fox 2. Oh, we got him too. Wow, these Fox 2s are great. Splash 1 MiG-21 right in the field there. Very good. Alright, uh, I'm gonna extend out of here now, so I don't get, you know, shot from behind like that guy did. And we're gonna extend out of the fight and then we'll turn back around and recommit and see what we can do from there. Now the F-4, very similar to the F-14, got some really heavy action during the Iran-Iraq war. Um, I actually think they were the, the aircraft that did the first ever attack on a nuclear reactor, uh, the Osirak reactor for Iraq. Uh, we got a video on that on the Minidocs channel if you want to check that out. I'll have links to that in the pinned comments below. We have an F-14 up high, looks like he's on the tail of uh, Iraqi MiG, that's an F-5, okay. Is it an F-5? Yeah, that's an F-5. They're both chasing that guy. <laughs> that's the, the MiG-21. And looks like he's defending... Oh, never mind. <laughs> well, he broke up pretty hard there. <laughs> yeah, I think the F-14 got him. Maybe the Phantom. 
I think the Phantom actually got him. Good kill. Such a good looking aircraft. Look at that thing. Beautiful. You guys are gonna have to let me know uh, if you're looking forward to the Heepler Phantom. I have no idea when it's coming out. This is the best we got <laughs> until it comes out. Uh, got a whole bunch of flak in the air here. So there's something not friendly hanging around. And I think it's that guy over there. Yeah, look at that. That's a uh, Iraqi Mirage F1. And it looks like he's taking a lot of uh, fire from Sam's. But other than that, he's all alone out here. So I'm going to kill him. I'm going to try anyway. <laughs> If that Sam doesn't get him first. Oh, there he is. Oh, he dodged that Sam. Wow, this guy doesn't want to die. Fox 2. He's really fighting for his life. Splash 1. <laughs> oh, if I didn't get him, the Sam was going to get him, I think. Good kill. Poor guy. I feel bad for him. Alright, we're gonna provide some cover for these guys. They're gonna bomb an Iraqi uh, command and control center. A decision making center, if you will. Look at this nice, beautiful close formation here. I got the air to air loadout, so we'll kill anything that shows up. Okay, something pinged me from over here. Uh, it's radar got me and I, I'm pretty sure it was in this direction. I don't know what it was yet though. Um, those guys hit their target and they're off and I gotta defend them here. Uh, looks like they had a good effect on target though. I saw many explosions. Uh, see there it is again. Something over here is... Maybe was protecting that decision making center. Didn't do a very good job. But it's coming over here right now. It's right in front of me. There we go. Look at this. Got him on radar. Less than 10 miles off the nose. Locked. And let's send it. Fox 1. holding that lock. I don't have a lot of faith in the Sparrow, so I might follow it up with a second shot here. I don't even have the HUD in air-to-air -air mode. That's okay. The radar still got the lock. And, oh, it got him. Oh, I thought that was going to miss. Wow. Got lucky there. Alright, splash one. That looked like a F1. Look at that. What is this? What do we got here? That that's a Iraqi. Yeah, that's an that's an F1. A turn. I he definitely saw me, I think. How could he not, right? Yeah, he's reversing into me, it looks like. Ah, oh, I can't see him in the sun. Look, he shot a missile too. There goes his missile, but where'd he go? Oh, there he is. Right there, right there. Should I stay on a six here? I don't know who he's engaging. Oh, he's getting... Oh, ho, 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 he got hit by AAA. Wow, that's the first time I've seen AAA be so effective. Oh, that guy ate it hard. Wow. Another one bites the dust.
Okay, we're gonna continue the hunt. More AAA over here. Shooting at something. What is that? That's a parachute. What's that? Tomcat? That's a Tomcat. And he's shooting at something. What's he shooting at? That's another Tomcat download. That's a MiG-21 right there. Fox 2. Yeah, my Fox 2 looked like it was tracking. He's dodged like four missiles, this guy. Oh, got him. <laughs> I'm getting really good performance out of these Sidewinders. Tomcat in the air. Another MiG-21 up high. I'm gonna try to pull him into the HUD. Iranian Phantom down low. What's this? What's this? F5. I should have stayed on that MiG-21. Uh, what's this? going on here? What's going on here? Missile out on somebody. That's a Phantom. Just shot a missile at something that hit the ground. It missed. It hit that F1 and that F1 crashed. Oh. Oh, he maneuver killed himself. It looked like he got real slow to try to dodge that missile. And, you know, in his defense, it worked. He did dodge the missile. It's just that then he had no lift. <laughs> All right. Good kill to that phantom. He'll be talking about that one in the chow hall. Let's see if we can find another guy to dust off here and get out of our airspace. Usually the Iraqi fighters didn't stick around long once Tomcats showed up. And there's at least a couple of Tomcats here. Look at this, I'm slotting right on the back of this MiG-21. He didn't see a thing and his afterburner's lit. Come on, give me tone. Give me that little star that tells me you have tone. The star tells me the Sidewinder can see him. There it is, Fox 2. Oh yeah, there you go. <laughs> he never saw it coming. Poor guy. And impact. Splash 1, make 21. Those are my favorite kind of kills. Lit afterburner, Fox 2, right up the tailpipe. <laughs> 